proof and I will show you how to connect to your uh, Citrix uh, uh, VDNA box instance running a Windows 7 VM from an iPad. Before you connect uh, you need the uh, the uh, Citrix uh, receiver installed from the uh, Apple App Store um, so it's available on Mac, uh, Mac, uh, Mac App Store and Apple App Store as well as Android App Store as well so I'm just gonna show you how to connect from an iPad so I have the app installed already okay so this is uh, the app so before you connect to your VDI in a box instance usually uh, you have to create a connection shortcut here and add your account which basically involves uh, entering your VDI in a box server IP address or URL uh, so that it can bring the uh, the page login page so I've already created so I'm just gonna press it here and it should present me the login screen so I'm just gonna pause the video enter my credentials and I'll get back to you again okay so I have entered my credential I'm just gonna log in okay so it's uh, launching my uh, desktop here in this uh, tablet and looks like uh, I have my desktop here so as you if you notice uh, closely um, it, it uh, the Citrix uh, VDN box uh, uh, application um, rearranged my uh, icons on the desktop uh, to match this resolution on this tablet so so that it's uh, easy to touch uh, it made the icon a little bit bigger uh, and also there is a customized start menu here so it's not the regular Windows start menu uh, as you see here so I can uh, you know go to uh, my documents sorry all programs and you know I have my programs here so I'm gonna bring up the Firefox I forgot to actually sorry okay Firefox I'm just gonna go to YouTube now to get the keyboard you have to press this uh, app drawer here it's a uh, you know uh, it gives you access to your keyboard pointer mouse pointer settings and you know Bluetooth pairing and so forth so I'm just gonna get the keyboard here go to YouTube okay so I got the YouTube here so I'm gonna play a 7 I'll play 720p video since iPad 2 it can handle the uh, there's no point of using uh, 1080p can be uh, since I don't have the retina display the losses you have the losses you have had to suffer so I have it in full screen so do. as you see it's pretty native performance uh, actually it's running on the server the actually it's running on the uh, Zen server VM uh, and not using local resource even the iPod iPad 2 is you know, not so heavy as the desktop uh, it's running all that uh, it's streaming via the HDX technology so that's pretty cool um, and uh, thank you for watching